this is a four row repeat worked on a multiple of 10. For my sample, I have 20 stitches. I'm using some heavy worsted weight yarn on US size seven needles. For row one, you just knit all stitches. For row two, you start by knitting four. And then you purl two. And then your repeat is knit eight. Purl two, and then when you get to the last four stitches, you knit. Row three, you knit three. Now we're going to cross two back. I'm going to show you the fussy fiddly way and then the way that I think is a lot easier to do it. So you're going to need a cable needle or a spare double pointed needle. And you're just going to slip the first stitch from your left needle onto your cable or double pointed needle. And then hold that in the back of your work and then you're going to knit the next stitch from your left needle and then you're going to knit that stitch that you've been holding in the back of the work and I'll show you the other way in a minute and then next we're going to cross to front. So you take your spare needle and you slip the next stitch on your left needle onto your spare needle. And this time hold it in the front of your work and knit the next stitch from your left needle. and then you knit the stitch that you've been holding in the front of the work so that's how you start row three you knit three and then you cross two back and then you cross two front and then your repeat is knit six Now we're going to cross two back again, and this is the way I like to do it. It's much easier and less fiddly than using a spare DPN or a cable needle. So you're just going to take the next two stitches on your left needle and just pinch them at the bottom of the stitches, and you just slide them off your needle. Then you take your left needle and you go behind your second stitch grab the first stitch and slide that back onto your left needle and then you bring your second stitch and put that onto your left needle so you've just switched places and then you knit them And now cross two front. So again, I'm going to take my next two stitches. I'm going to slide them off my needle while I'm pinching them. 
And this time you're going to take your left needle and go in front of the second stitch and grab the first stitch and put it back on your left needle. And then just reach around and grab that second stitch and pull it around and slip it back onto the left needle and knit them. And that gives you the same result as using the cable needle, but it's much quicker once you get used to doing it that way. So the repeat section for row three, knit six, cross two back, and cross two front. And then when you get to the last three stitches, you just knit them. And row four, you're just going to purl all stitches. And you just repeat those four rows for the pattern.